<laughs> okay, so moving on here. Americans are reconsidering what it means to work in a post-pandemic world. In fact, researchers have coined the term the great resignation as millions are quitting jobs in search of better work-life balance while others are simply getting back into the workforce after layoffs. Our Amy Pathrap joins us now. Amy, good morning to you. You met this professor who has found her true passion, which is baking. My people, I okay? Know. It's my kind of I people. Know. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Get ready to wipe the drool because this story is going to make you salivate. Like <laughs> so many, Dr. Shika lost her job due to COVID layoffs, but she says she's found the freed up time liberating, giving her time to reconnect with a childhood passion and even turning it into her paycheck. And why not? Life is sweeter when it involves daily cupcake tastings. When life gives you lemons, make lemon drop cookies. Dr. Sheikha Little is doing just that out of her new Culver City kiosk. Sometimes I have to pinch myself. I'm like, okay, is this real? Do I, am I really living the dream? This is actually what I always dreamed of doing. The South Carolina native recently put down roots in her dream city, and the former education manager has COVID to thank for expediting her vision. This opportunity really just literally fell into my lap. I had a plan for like three to five years to open up a bakery. So after being laid off for COVID, I had I had no idea what I was going to do at that point. I was like, okay, we're going to ever go back to work. And right away, my natural instinct was, okay, people are at home. People are looking for comfort food. One of the best comfort foods that I know are desserts. And I'm not a good cook as far as like cooking traditional foods, but desserts, I got that one. The bubbly baker turned to the recipes she began perfecting at the ripe old age of 12. I had an easy bake oven, but I kind of graduated from that. I was like, okay, I'm ready for the real kitchen. <laughs> I would actually go to my grandmother's house during the summertime, and I would experiment with her, with her items in her kitchen, and she would let me. She started selling her sweets as a side hustle and really tested the waters in December 2019 with a holiday pop-up in Glendale. That laid the foundation for this new permanent location at Westfield Fox Hills. Our customers are actually traveling from Glendale and Long Beach and everywhere of that, you know, in this metro LA area. They're actually traveling here now to our location. Angelinos are willing to brave LA traffic to enjoy a bit of Dr. Sheikah's Southern comfort. She's constantly adjusting inventory to account for her customer base, including a growing number of plants plant-based eaters. Black Americans make up for more vegans than any other population. One thing we had to learn is how many cookies they have or how many vegan cookies they have. And we were really amazed that this population here has a lot of vegan customers. Satisfying her adoring fans makes the hurdle of getting her almost famous brownies all the way from her test kitchen in Pasadena to the west side in LA traffic worth it. I work around the clock. I am driving from Culver City to Bacon, Pasadena. My day starts really early. My day starts about 4 a.m., but it's worth it. It's worth it when I have customers to tell me that this is the best dessert they've had. Just getting the joy of hearing people, just seeing the smiles on their faces when they taste our food really is worth it. Dr. Sheikah's true Hollywood story is sure is a sweet one. From a South Carolina girl, from a very small town with only a couple of red lights, this Hollywood girl is happy now. <laughs> and like a box of sweets, happiness is better when shared. Dr. Sheikah is as sweet as those desserts, and she says the number one thing they sell out of every day, those red velvet cupcakes, you guys. It's the cream cheese frosting for me. Mine didn't even make it home. So try it for yourself at Dr. Sheikah's Westfield Culver City kiosk. She's just outside of Forever 21, and she is there seven days a week. Is that why we have no boxes of goodies? Well, hold up. No, she also morning. has uh, ice cream sandwiches, y'all, too. Get up that Instagram, Dr. Sheikah's Bakery. Delicious. Uh, does she deliver, or do she I need does. to go right after work, or can I get something else? <laughs> <now? laughs> within a couple of hours and they do ship locally and also nationwide so if you've got friends and families elsewhere that you'd like to spoil you can customize a box of yummy treats they'll arrive individually wrapped ready to eat or freeze and it's such a sweet gift for the graduate in your life or maybe for a birthday or anniversary you can order all the goodies at drsheikahsbakery.com you can almost smell those cookies they oh look God. you can see the butter she in even has a mm. vegan brownie sundae look at that yeah. oh look at my that. goodness it looks yum. delicious yeah. amy thank you as thank always you so for bringing much, us something good yeah <laughs> always <laughs> Thank you. Take care, my friend. <laughs> we'll be back, everybody. Ooh, look Eddie at that. Order. It looks delicious. <laughs>